Hey guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for those customers who's using Samsung Android smartphone. I mean to say if you're using Samsung Android smartphone like M series, S series, F series, any kind of series if you're using the Samsung Android smartphone and if your Android smartphone is logged due to forgotten pin pattern and password logged and if you have if you want to visit service and don't, don't worry at all. Here at the sitting at home by this method, you can unlock your smartphone without wasting any service center. Okay. First of all, you will have to hard reset your smartphone. Then after hard reset, I mean to say factory data reset. When you will switch on your phone, you will get a such type of display. You can see here, you will get a welcome pop-up. Okay. And you will get a three type of op option. You can see here the first one is showing here language. The second one is start and the third one is emergency call. Before starting this method, your phone should be charged at least 30%. Otherwise, whatever data you have in your smartphone can be deleted. Okay. So before you start this method you should charge your phone at least 30 percent or you may also use your smartphone charger uh, at the time of using this unlocking method okay so let's start this method let's check what happened uh, when i go with this start button click on this and check out all these options agree to all and go to the agree here okay now go to the more and agree now one more thing i would like to tell you you will have to connect your phone to the wi-fi network you can see here i have connected my a smartphone to the Wi-Fi network then after you will have to go to the next option here when you will go to the next option here it's asking your pin pattern or password lock which type of lock you have applied to your smartphone that will ask on this space but you will get an another option that is showing here use my Google uh, account instead simply you may uh, click on this let's check what happened here now after that you can see here it's asking your uh, verify google account credential it means if you have your gmail id and your password then you may go with that gmail id and password and bypass this space but if you don't have your gmail id and password then you can't get a skip option on this space okay so if you have your gmail id then go through this process and if you don't have your gmail id and password so i am going to give you some tips and tricks by which you can uh, get a skip option on this page and unlock your device okay so after that simply you will have to reach to the start page here okay now here you will have to select the language option and you will have to uh, change the language from english india to english uk and go to the okay here now here you will get an option of emergency call okay simply you will have to click on this emergency call option now after that you will have to dial a special ussd code that is star has zero star has and when you will click on this uh, star has zero star has code you will get a such type of display here you will get a lots of option on this page but uh, especially you will have to go to the option that is showing here here sensor option okay simply you will have to click on this sensor option when you will click on this sensor option you will get a three type of option that is showing here accelerometer sensor and virtual uh, sensor and uh, zero scope sensor okay it will show here show you here some synchronizing uh, process so you will have to wait on this uh, pace for five second minimum maximum there is no limit so minimum you will have to uh, wait here for five seconds so i think five second has been done after that i will go with the back button here okay now the another option you can see here that is showing here your version option simply you will have to click on this version option and when you will click on this version option here you will get uh, some uh, versions model name here you will have to again wait here for five second minimum then your five second been done simply you will have to go to the back button and back button and you will have to reach to the uh, welcome page okay now here after that you will have to go to the start option here okay now when you will start this simply you will have to check all these options go to the agree and you will have to again here agree option okay now here uh, after that you will have to go to the uh, talkback option and you will have to switch on your phone's talkback so for that simply you will have to press the power button and the volume up button for five seconds hold and press and release for five seconds your talkback option which will switch on like this use uh, you will have to click here on use and again you will have to tap the same uh, process here and release okay now here you will have to draw a opposite L okay now you will get an option of while using this app simply you will have to double tap on this click on this you will have to click on this voice command option open Google assistant Open setting. 
when your phone setting option will be open in your phone display like this simply you will have to switch off your talkback option and for that simply again you will have to do the same process volume up button and the power button you will have to press and hold for 5 seconds here and release to switch off your talkback option when your talkback option switch off here uh, you will have to make some changes on this page uh, firstly you will have to go to the general management uh, options and here you will get an option of uh, reset option simply firstly you will have to uh, reset press the reset option then after that you will have to go to the language option and here you will have to go to the add language here now here you will have to choose some other language that is english and uh, set as default and uh, go to the edit option and you will have to select this english uk and go to the apply here okay now after that again you will have to go to the back option and here you will have to go to the back here now here you will have to reach to the option that is showing here a screen lock lock screen simply you will have to click on this option here you will get a lots of option but you will have to go to the option that is showing here about lock screen simply you will have to click on this you will get a page such type of here and you will have to click on this open source license simply you will have to click on this now here you will get a lots of things on this page but simply you will have to select this web address select and copy this web address okay when it uh, you will have to copy here and go to the back option okay now after that go to the back again you will have to go to the back here and you will have to go to the back option okay now you will have to click on this close option now after that you can see here there is an option of showing here that is add network simply you will have to click on this add network option now here you will have to type all and in capital samsung m o v e remove frp and then you will have to go to the save okay now after that again you will have to click on this add network option and uh, cross this one here you will get an option of setting simply you will have to click on this setting option okay now after that you will have to go to the uh, down scroll down and you will get an option of reset to default setting simply you will have to click on this and you will have to click on both these options the first one is showing here reset keyboard setting simply you will have to reset this and the second one is showing here that is erase personalized prediction simply you will have to erase this also okay now after that you will have to go to the option that is showing here suggest uh, suggest text correction sorry you will have to go to the text shortcut okay now after that you will get an option of add simply you will have to click on this add option now here you will have to type f r p b y p a double s sorry now here you will have to paste that uh, uh, web address which you have copied from that page and you will have to click on this add option okay now go to the back option here now the last changes is showing here that is your language simply you will have to select here and go to the manual input language option and here you will have to select uh, english all the english you will get here that is english uk us select all them all of them and go to the back option now all the setup has been done now you have to check either your smartphones uh, uh, Google account IFRP bypass has been done or not so go to the back option back option and back option okay now go to the start page here okay now all the setup has been done let's check what happened here go to the start click all to the agree go to the agree here more next now here you will have to click on this next button Now you will get a two option that is showing here don't copy and next simply you will have to select this don't copy option so you can see here my friend on this page that uh, was asking your gmail id and password you want uh, you didn't get a skip option but uh, right now uh, with the help of some make changes changes in your settings you can see here you had got a skip option here okay so now simply you can uh, click on this escape option and bypass this page simply you will have to click on this and uh, skip this page here now after that uh, you will have to click on this accept option 
Now, if you want to use new pin pattern and password, then you may go with this page. But right now, I will skip this option. But one more thing I would like to tell you, my friend, if your phone is unlocked with the help of this method, then within one hour, you will have to change your uh, pin pattern and password. I mean to say you will have to apply new pin pattern or password or whatever you want to make your phones lock. Okay. Otherwise, your previous pin pattern and password will be automatically activated on your smartphone and you will have to repeat this process again. Okay. So if your phone is unlocked, so within one hour, make sure uh, complete your uh, setup with the new pin pattern and password okay so now you can see here uh, you will get a pop-up of your all setup it means your all the setup has been done simply you will have to click on this finish option now after that here you will have to go to the agree here Now here it will ask you to select a language so I will suggest you select a single language you can also skip this page but uh, select a single language here. Now go to the continue. Now install finish finish. So my friend you can see here the Samsung Android smartphone is completely unlocked you can see here all the application which were pre-installed in my smartphone like Bajos, Joes and all the application which were uh, uh, in my smartphone when my phone was not logged as it is showing here you can see here so this method is very useful for those customers who don't want to lose their smartphone data like photos videos and documents you can use this method to unlock your smartphone and uh, bypass your frp here okay so if your smartphone is unlocked with the help of this method then do the like this video and if your smartphone could not unlock with the help of this method then make us comment which type of issues you're facing in this method our team will quick response on your issues thank you so much